Hello, this is Adam Rayner for Slingshot World TV. Today we're testing targets and that means we're hunting for Slingshot Stig. I set up a target rich environment. See if we can lure him out of the woods. Oi, Slingshot Stig, you out there? Stiggy! Oi, Stig! Stig! Oh, mate! Oh, he's gone. He's gone. We'll have to go and hunt him. Stalk the stick. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? I've got to find Slingshot Stig. He's here in the woods somewhere. He's here somewhere. I'm sure of it. Stiggy, Slingshot Stig. Where are you at, mate? Uh, bloody hell. We'll find him. We'll find him. Well, I've been walking through the woods and I, I think I've found where he might be. Stig, you in there? Slingshot Stig! Oh, mate. <sighs> All right, geese, let's go do this. Nice one. God, when you do get hold of him, he won't stop talking. Nah. But, yep, here we are. We're going to test these targets for Slingshot Stig. But uh, before we go on, a little word from Slingshot Stig's uh, clothing sponsor, which is Military First. Come on, camera, you can do that. Yes, military first. Gear up for action. Ghillie suits and all kinds of other things. All right, Stiggy. Knock the crap out of those targets for us, geese. Oh. These are from Milbro. And that crow just died on Stig's first shot. They're marking these in various ways. <laughs> That'd be the rat. Why he slingshot Stig. No marks on his targets. It's the first time he's seen him. Oh, that's what you get for nagging in his ear. Those other two spinners a little bit further away. All of these are from uh, Sports Marketing. The Milbro brand. Ding! That made a good noise. We're marking these in um, various ways, as I say. Let me grab the notes and I'll tell you. Yep, we're somewhere near a road. So, fun factor. Is it a larf? Does it spin? Does it ping or explode? Durability, is it made to last? Will it put up with, will it put up with our rain of hell? What is it disposable? A little snappy thing or a single banger? What about value for money? How good is it for your catapult pound? To be honest, I haven't got you got the retails of these yet. You're a slingshot dollar, all things considered. And then features. Does it just spin or chime? Does it knock down or a stand back up feature? Dude. I think these are going to go pretty well on the durability. Hunt realism. Does it emulate the hunting experience in any way? Flapping, moving, flying. These, of course, are little uh, silhouettes. I think they're pretty damn good. Okay, there's an insect on that bit of string that's going to get a nasty wake-up call. That's a Dang Kung 304 stainless steel spinner. The thing is, Nicholas Slingshot, a Frenchman, posted me the pile of wreckage you've seen in the stills of the two broken ones and this one because he says they break on every single shot and... Well, Stiggy's going to have a little shoot at this. Be, go on, Stiggy, be gentle with it, guys. Let's we'll see if we can take any shots at all. Oh, that was just to tell the insect to get out of there. <sighs> Whoa. Nice, that took it. One dent. Yeah, was the man just unlucky? We don't know. Yeah, he's just clipping it. Could be the lib. Go on, Steve, smack it one. Oh, seriously, close bit of grouping going on there from Slingshot Stig. Interesting. 
So I wonder, is uh, our Frenchman shooting with... Uh, it's mayhem going on behind it. Is our Frenchman shooting with 12 mils? Because the dent you'd get on a, t on a target is um, pretty much going to be the same. Little tiny round dent, depending on where you're getting it. It's just clipping the edge for us. Just hearing these things coming past is pretty cool. Got our Stiggy stood uh, a good 10 metres downrange. I can tell you that uh, despite the new trend from China, Slingshot Stig shoots 9.5. What I can say is that the Frenchman who's been shooting these and breaking them on his first shot. Must be one full butterfly, big ball bastardos, because there's no toys about it. Stiggy is knocking seven shades of shizazzle out of that Dan Kung 304. These things are about who uses them. Makes a good noise, doesn't it? But the other two are busted. Well, ladies and gentlemen, how many hits do you count there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's that's more than ten hits. I think we're just going to have to accept that the Frenchman was a psychopath. Because that ain't been spared. That's been hit a lot. I think we're going to have to call that a pass. That has to be one of the most badly tied bits of string ever. These spinners are made by wasps specifically to be able to hang on a nice bit of paracord beautifully. Make a good whap noise when you hit them. So that higgledy-piggledy array, it's going to give you guys an internet room to say, Slingshot World, what the hell are you playing at? <laughs> Look, I was a bit nervous about finding Slingshot Stig, okay? That is the quote-unquote piece of useful string from my Swiss Army knife, all right? <laughs> I've got a picture in the catch box feature of my catch box. And you can see them hung up beautifully because basically what spinners start at 2.95 for a pack up to 10 quid and they're as cheap as 69 pence each. And they are almost indestructible. <coughs> so much so that if anybody does manage to break one, they post a picture of it like it was a clever thing. Oh, I broke a wasp spinner. But at flumpence each, they're amazing value, and you're going to do hard pit. Go on, Stiggy, hit the pink one. Pink one, pink one. Whoa! <laughs> How about that green one, then? A little teeny weeny green one that's hanging up properly. Oh, I've challenged him. Flipping it. Ladies and gentlemen, slingshot Stig. Yes. I can tell you that setting up this has taken longer than the shooting. And that. Well, Slingshot Stiggers smack the cacker out of these things. First shot pretty much every time. So who is Slingshot Stig? Okay, we've saved the best till last. As you can see, that's a fair old distance away from anybody. Yeah, Slingshot Stig is standing in a straight line to the RMX Barrow board. I'll say that again. He's standing in a straight line to the RMX Barrage board. These are 9 99 each. They go bang, and they're only going to go bang if Stiggy hits it in an area the size of the ball he's shooting. So I'm not going to put it under pressure. Just get on, dude. Shoot a will. And we'll just leave it running, see if they go off. Pock. <laughs> he's hitting that hard. Stig normally only concerns himself with something the size of a pigeon's head. The fact is, in this case, He's trying to get that spot where, well, crank of the eye. That is a tiny, tiny little target. These are made for air gunners. But I'm telling you, sooner or later, he's going to twat that bit right in the middle of the how loud it is. He 
You're getting close, do you reckon? <laughs> you can see the dents in the board. Was that me or did the actual banger just pop out of the board? Have you beaten up the board to the point where the banger fell out? Let's just cut there for a second. Stick, go and have a look, see if you knock the banger out. Interesting. Catapults. We've knocked two of the banger things clean out the front there. Let's put them back. Could be our mount allowing some spring there. Maybe it should be against a uh, something more rigid. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 I think I got that within the five seconds. I've been sitting there on pre-roll. <laughs> I have to see if I've caught that. I have to see if I've caught that. Stop a set, Siggy. Dude. I think Stiggy's got this dialed in. That is equivalent of a trick shot no wider than one ball. Flipping it! Two in a row! <laughs> That's why he slingshot Stig. Some say that at night he bathes his balls of steel in oil so that they do not rust. All we know is he slingshot Stig. Okay, I was just starting to think the barrage ball might not be suitable for catapulters because, well, Stiggy was beating the cacker out of it and some of the little poppy bits were actually leaving the board without exploding and then he shot one it went boom and then he shot one and it went boom and popped out the back second one in from the left of the picture it's quite clearly dented the only dent on the target is right in the middle of it, it exploded straight out the back if you hit them otherwise they blow the front off but uh... so the barrage board that's a challenging fun piece of kit and it seems to be reasonably, reasonably good at lasting, but you got to admit it. Slingshot Stig, what a demon shot. We got that live. One, then the second one. The second one was that one. Just dented in the middle of it, nothing else. <laughs> Slingshot Stig.